Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Just a quick video to let you know that in Microsoft Edge Canary, which is a pre-release version of Edge that Microsoft uses to test and experiment on new features, um, they have started to test a new option in a Canary, which allows web apps to handle links that are within their scope. So basically what that means is that uh, the link will open in the web app now instead of the browser in a new tab. Now, like most features, in Edge Canary, it's not a default feature and we have to enable a flag to uh, enable the option. So to do this, we head to the address bar and we enter edge colon forward slash forward slash flags. And in the search, you enter this flag. I'm going to paste it in. Enable opening supported links with installed web apps. And the description for this flag says, if a link opened from the operating system is within the scope of an installed web app, the web app can be launched to handle the link navigation as mentioned. And we change the default uh, setting for the flag to enabled. We restart Edge Canary to apply that flag. And now if we just head to our apps, to the menu, click on apps, and I'm just gonna go to the manage apps page. Yeah, if we go to, as, a, as an example, I've installed YouTube as a PWA, a progressive web app. And if I go to details now, you will see now a new little option at the bottom here. Link handling lets this application open links to youtube.com. And it says in the description, setting this app as a handler will remove other apps that might be opening links to youtube.com. And we just enable that. And now and when you click, when you click on a link pertaining to YouTube, um, that will open now in the actual PWA, the web app, instead of opening um, in a new tab in the browser itself. Now, this feature, as mentioned, is still being tested and has just started to be tested and is not currently available in the stable version. But I will keep you posted as to any developments um, as it is a feature that could possibly roll out to the stable version in the near future. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.